Hello, my name is Hansi Fargo and my university ID is 2126466. Today I am demonstrating the taxi booking system and first of all I'll go through with ER diagram. Here in my ER diagram there are seven entities. They are customer, billing, employees, my activity, admin, driver and booking. And each entities are as uh, have the, their coordinated ratio with each other. I have also given the relations of each entities. And here in class diagram, I have uh, seven classes and each classes have their associations. And this is my clam level diagram. Here in clam level diagram, there are three actors. They are customer, driver and admin. And each actor have their uh, direct association with each other, other use case. And this is a customer activity diagram and in customer activity diagram, I have given all the actions or activity that customer perform while using the customer dashboard. And this is the admin activity diagram and in here admin activity diagram, I have also given all the actions that the admin performs while using the system. <coughs> And this is the driver activity diagram and in driver activity diagram also I have given all the action that the driver perform. This is my program taxi booking system here if a customer don't have an account then they can create an account using the sign up form. Here in sign up form I have uh, used the regex validation to um, uh, add uh, validation in each field. Uh, to check the correct format and if customer already have an account then they can use their email and password to access the system. Uh, like I'll use one customer account to access the customer dashboard okay seven okay this is a uh, customer dashboard and here in customer dashboard uh, customer can also see the current uh, location uh, by using this map and customer can request the trip uh, from here Like I'll set the pickup address and drop up address and customer cannot use the previous date uh, pickup date and I'll set the time okay on p.m. I'll request it okay the booking is requested successfully and if I'll click on or uh, click again on request booking mm -hmm. then it shows that you have requested on this date already uh, that means that uh, customer cannot request the same uh, booking on the same date and time until the admin confirm the previous booking. Here is the here it so only the pending booking uh, where customer can uh, update or cancel the pending booking from here. Like customer can change the pickup date or pickup time if or he see one mm -hmm. it here in this way. And here it shows the riding history and customer can also see the uh, report of like how many time the customer has. Uh, access his or her account uh, <clears throat> and it also shows the booking record on the basis of date and customer can also see the activity of each or her account like on which date and time and from which system uh, the account was accessed before and customer can also see the profile details from my profile and it shows two options uh, view profile and update profile if customer click on the view profile then customer can see the details and if customer want to update the profile details then customer can click on the update profile uh, bottom customer can also see the booking history from here and customer can also see the driver history from here and customer can also see the driver number uh, this help customer uh, to call the driver if customer has forget some luggage on the taxi and customer can also see the billing history from here like how much money they have spent uh, using this system it also shows the total amount and customer can also change the password and customer can also delete the account if he or she want to delete mm -hmm. it for now I'll cancel it and if customer want to change the password then if uh, in this way the both account the both passports should be matched and mm -hmm. here it says the, pa the passport is changed successfully now it shows directly to login page switch to login page now I'll use one account customer account okay uh, this is another customer account here. I have uh, here. I have edited the uh, pickup date to the previous date and if customer want to update the uh, Booking uh, using the previous date then it shows that you have updated date. Please select the new pickup date This means that customer cannot use the uh, pre if customer mistakenly use the previous date then also customer cannot uh, update or cancel that uh, booking uh, that booking needs to be cancelled by the admin 
so i'll go to admin dashboard Uh, this is the admin dashboard and in admin dashboard admin can see the total customers total booking total drivers and the total revenues that is generated by the taxi booking system customer uh, admin can also see the uh, like pending or uh, booking list from here and admin can also source the customer by using the customer name uh, like I'll use one customer name and I'll source it uh, and admin cannot see the password of each customer admin can also source the driver details from here uh like this and admin can also see the uh, employees detail using the employees name and admin can also see the report of customer driver booking and billing like admin can see the customer details like how many male and female has created an account on this system and the daily customer booking analysis on the basis of date and admin can also see the driver report like uh, how many drivers are active how many drivers are inactive and booked currently and they also shows the, like how many driver were assigned on each day and admin can also see the booking report like how many bookings are like completed and how many bookings are cancelled till now and how many bookings are pending are pending and they also see like daily booking report uh, on the basis of date and admin can also see the billing report like how much money is generated on each day from this graph okay and admin can also add the customer using this uh, customer management systems uh, here admin can perform like um, uh, admin can create an account admin can update the customer details and admin can delete an account uh, but admin cannot uh, update the customer's passport if i'll source the customer like details using the customer id then here it shows the passport uh, using ASCII encoded system that means that admin cannot see the customer's passport in the same way um, admin can also uh, add the driver or create the driver account using this driver management system and admin can also source the driver uh, using the driver ID in this way and here also admin cannot see the driver passport and admin can also add the employees detail and source it by using the admin uh, employees ID okay and admin can also see the active booking from here like uh, currently uh, which customer is assigned to which driver that uh, admin can see here like customer name is Nikita Thapa and driver name is Suiksa Bosnet and the status is booked currently and admin can also see the billing history from here like uh, how much money is generated by the system and which customer has traveled to which these places uh, they can also see like kilometer unit and total amount from the billing history now uh, i'll go to the assigned driver where the admin will assign the driver to the customer and here i have the two pending list and one pending list uh, have the current uh, pickup uh, date whereas uh, another pending list have the outdated date and if i'll select it it will as i'll click on the assigned driver then it says that please enter the driver id okay what if i'll enter the driver id like new limbo and i'll click again on the assigned driver then it says this customer has outdated pickup address that means this, that means that this customer's uh, uh, booking request should be cancelled for now. Okay, now the booking is cancelled successfully, and I'll just click another uh, pending list here. It it has the current date, and I'll just click OK again on the new Flimbo, and I'll assign that the driver is assigned successfully, and that that driver is not shown here. Okay. Now I'll go to the driver dashboard. Okay. and this is the driver dashboard and here the driver can see the total riding total booked a ride completed and the ride cancelled from here and driver can also see the current booked um, uh, customer data here the currently the new limbo is booked his status is booked currently and uh, like uh, driver can also change the appearance mode from here in this way there are two appearance mode that is dark and light uh, this appearance mode is given in each dashboard and here here um, driver will set uh, the trip as completed and from here driver can see the trip history previous trip history driver can also change the password and currently the new limbo is booked now what I'll select this as a completed and I'll click on the complete trip 
now again the new limbo will be active and it uh, new limbo will be available on the admin and the admin can assign the new limbo again on the another trip now i'll log out and i'll again go to admin dashboard okay now here in admin dashboard uh, the trip which is completed will be shown here in the payment list here now i'll click here and it will show the customer name and credit card number and i'll just say uh, this unit is non-editable it is it cannot be edited and i'll just set the kilometer here like 34 kilometer then it will just grant total it will show the grand total amount and i'll just click on the generate bill here the bill is generated and that history will be shown here again and the amount will be sum up and i can just see the voucher here in the taxi booking billing and this is the current voucher which was which is generated okay this is the voucher it's uh, it shows the uh, bill number and through this uh, this bill number and this file number is same and customer can source uh, the voucher using this bill number and this is the current transactions date and time and this is the customer name pickup address drop off address uh, this is the pickup date and time and from here description we can so uh, you can see that the total kilometers unit and total amount i'll just zoom out this voucher okay and uh, this was all about my project uh, taxi booking system thank you